In 2011, the people of Makindia Division in Kampala overwhelmingly voted in favor of Dr. Ian Clark, who stood on an independent ticket platform. Dr. Clark is a proprietor of Kampala International Hospital. After three years of service delivered to the people of Makindia, his division stands out from the rest in terms of service delivery. Because I believe that's my job, to make sure these things work better, to make sure we get better value for money, to make sure the potholes are fixed, to make sure if there's issues with the new roads being made. Unlike other politicians who preach water and drink wine, Clark is pragmatic. The problems we have with some of our politicians is they don't have the technical competence really to call the, the, the technical staff to account. I am highly involved with the technical side. In fact, uh, when we are doing our job, uh, then some party wants to come along and take credit for it. Uh, it's not, these are not party issues. These are issues of um, uh, local government. The roads in Makindye, health centers and schools are in good shape. The Makindye mayor believes the conflict between the Lord Mayor Elias Rukwago and the executive director Jennifer Musisi has crippled the services delivered at the city hall. I have many frustrations as far as the job's concerned. I think we could have done much better. It's certainly a lot better than what was there before. Yeah, Take the, the politics out of Kampala. Take the politics out of it. It's about service delivery. And I, and I, I, I would say that uh, the Lord Mayor, Arias Lequago, he's a personable guy. He's been in politics a long time. He has a different view of his position than I have. For me, it's a position of leadership that you can bring the best values and bring development. Uh, and uh, so I, I feel a little sorry for him in, in the sense that he's been boxed in and he's there. He's Lord Mayor, but he's not Lord Mayor. He's not able to actually, actually function. Because of his tangible achievements so far, some sections of the public believe Clark is the man to take Kampala forward come 2016. But Clark remains undecided whether he should throw a hat in the ring during the 2016 elections. And is that going to be a worthwhile position? Mm -hmm. If that was a worthwhile position and I could make a difference in terms of leadership, then maybe it might be something that I should consider. But if it's going to be a big political fight, NRM, you know, those who, NRM and those who don't like the NRM, and it's going to be polarized, there's not going to be a position for me who is not in that kind of politics.